Hey guys, Gunwild here. Uh, I was tagged by NAFBRAT97 um, for which folding blade I would keep for the rest of my life. If I, if I could only choose one folding blade, which one would it be? Well, I have uh, all of my folding knife collection here. Um, got my one and only uh, Cold Steel, my one and only Spyderco, uh, a couple K bars, some CRKTs, uh, several Kershaws, a couple of Boker Magnums, a bunch of Smith and Wessons, a bunch of M Techs, and uh, some miscellaneous. There's Buck and Jeep and B. Um, uh, Sanren moves. There's just a, a variety of knives over here. But uh, pretty much the ones that I carry, the ones that are in my rotation as of right now. Um, several of these were in my rotation, but I have since kind of stopped carrying them. Like the Kershaw speed bump, you may have seen that video I did on that. I can't stand that lockup system. But anyway, the ones that I pretty much carry are all the ones that are out of the box right here. Um, get this, uh, this is uh, from, this is a Humvee. It's kind of a special deal that uh, my local sporting goods store had. It's a rescue knife. I carry that. Um, this is a Gerber paraframe that I got from Master Knife Collector. That's one of my, you know, in my rotation. Uh, my San Renmu uh, 939. I love that knife. Uh, this is uh, a Smoky Mountain Knife Works knife that I got from uh, DX Porker's Contest. It's um, the Smoky Mountain Knife Works brand of knife there. I carry that. And then I have my Kershaw's. Got the uh, half ton and the clash and the compound the tremor and my CRKT M16 14 ZSF okay if I had to choose one knife out of all the knives I have I used to have more, but I have given several away in the last uh, three, four months. Um, I've probably given close to ten knives away, but anyway, um, I carry two knives. I carry one large knife, which are like these three, um, and every now and then the the Spider Co Resilience. But, and I also carry a smaller knife, which is one of these. But if I had to choose just one knife out of my entire collection here, I keep coming back to the CRKT M16. Um, this knife has proven itself to me to be a very effective knife. I've probably probably been carrying this one for mm, six months or so now. And I love this thing. I keep coming back to it. It's sharp as all get up. It's still sharp as much as I use this thing. Um, Normally, when you have a, a Tonto blade knife, this edge isn't very sharp, but on this thing, it's fantastic. Um, <clears throat> if yeah, well, uh, I'm going one-handed here. If I could, I, I'd show you, do a cut test for you, but you know, I got the camera in one hand and the knife in the other, so I can't do that. Um, if I was an octopus, I could. <laughs> but anyway, I keep coming back to this knife. Um, so as of uh, right now, if I had to choose one knife out of all of them, it would be the CRKT M16-14 ZSF. I just, uh, I love that knife. It's very good quality. 
like I said, it's sharp as all get up. Um, it's retained its uh, sharpness as much of I, as I've used this blade. So, um, that's the one I'd keep for life. Uh, I guess I'm supposed to tag some people. Um, I, I really haven't been following this particular tag, so I don't know who's been tagged and who hasn't. Um, so I'm just going to leave it open. It's going to be an open tag. If anybody watching this wants to do a video on uh, which one folder they would keep for the rest of their lives, feel free to make it. I should actually probably pull this spider co out because that is, oops, in my rotation. I do carry this, but uh, I don't know, a knife that nice I kind of like to keep in the in the package. Spyderco Resilience. This is this has been a great knife. This is my one and only Spyderco. I probably won't ever get any more, but that's it. Set that right there. That's probably my biggest folder. This just a hair bigger than the CRKT. Um, so there you go. You guys, if you want to participate, feel free. Please do. I look forward to uh, your videos, and thanks for watching, guys. We'll talk to you later. Goodbye.